welcome back guys so update 24 is still not released and it has been three months of blocks foods without an update and today we're going to talk about the reasons why this, up this update was delayed and why it's taking this long and why it also could take a little bit longer by the way guys our 80,000 subscribers for permanent fruit is going to be starting soon and all you have to do in order to be part of this permanent truth is to like and subscribe this permanent fruit could be yours only if you subscribe and also we're gonna do a ton of giveaways because our goal is to reach 100,000 subscribers before June 30, 2024 and our goal is to do a ton of giveaways along the way so if you want to be part of future permanent food giveaways, dark blade giveaways and game pass giveaways all you have to do is to like and subscribe to this channel and join our discord and subscribe yeah help me reach 100,000 subscribers and we're gonna do a ton of giveaways I remember all the way back in December of 2023 when they first teased the Dragon Through 3 work. Actually, I remember all the way back in Update 20 when people were super mad that Dragon Through 3 work wasn't even going to be part of Update 20. Now, if you were part of this era or if you were part of this time or if you were already playing Block Suits during this time, you would know that a lot of people were mad that Dragon Through 3 work wasn't going to get added in Update 20 even though it was the first thing that they sneaked. And then they said they were going to release it for Christmas, which is funny because because you know Christmas came along and the Dragon Fruit rework was nowhere to be found and then people were saying and then you know I was one of the people that was saying that this is going to take a long time I was one of the people that was saying that this is gonna take a long time and people were hating on me because they were saying it's just a model issue it's gonna be done okay it's winter update part one it's gonna be done soon and here we are three months later and the update is still not released which is kind of funny and the reason why I'm talking about this is because the Bloxwoods devs have a is very notorious for delaying updates and taking ages with updates. Now, first and foremost, updates like these shouldn't really take this long because number one, Bloxwoods is a massive company with all the resources in the world to release updates as fast as possible. However, they don't and they take ages to release this update. But so actually, let's go talk about the reasons why this Dragon Fruit model was delayed. So a lot of people back then were saying, oh, it's copyright reasons because Anime Adventures also got taken down because of copyright from from um, GameFam. Yeah, GameFam was the studio that took down Anime Adventures. Damn it, GameFam. I really liked Anime Adventures, by the way. But yeah, um, with the takedown of Anime Adventures, the people said that um, the reason why they're delaying the dragon fruit model is because it looks a lot like kaido and we were gonna get copyrighted however it's confirmed by bread dopio already that the models were not copyrighted they weren't even close to looking like kaido he told me this himself and he's the maker of the dragon fruit model he said that it wasn't close to the copyright stuff it wasn't close to um to what kaido would look like and it wasn't close to being copyrighted and the reason why it was probably delayed is because of redesigns. If you will take a look at some of the older drafts and older models for Block Suits Dragon Rework, you will see these. And you will see that the older models and older drafts for Block Suits Dragon actually looks kind of like a Western Dragon. And Western Dragons, I believe, are they are basically the dragons with wings and tails and stuff like that they're the dragons with wings and eastern dragons which is the one kaido is like this is what an eastern dragon kind of looks like the eastern dragon looks like this and eastern dragons are they basically don't have the wings okay and the dragons the western dragon which was one of the older drafts for the dragon fruit rework looked kind of like this and if you take a look at it these are two very different dragon fruits and i think what happened was they redesigned the models basically they redesigned the models and and that's probably what happened and, and also one of admin e's live stream he did confirm that one of the reasons why dragon through 3 work took so long was because there were a lot of model redesigns because remember here rip indra and the developers of block suits even though they take a long time to release an update one thing that i noticed about them is that they try to make the update as good as possible as good as they can make it to be so i think the developers of block suits really just have this balance you know where they don't want to spend their entire life focusing on this game but they also want to deliver quality stuff which is why it's taking a little bit longer if you do compare block suits with some other games yes block suits does have um a lot of quality compared to other games but block suits takes a long time to release their updates Okay, so for example, for this update, they also did plan to just release the Dragon Fruit rework and then also just the Divine Arts. But apparently, somewhere along the line, this is also according to head admin's live stream that I watched that's now privated. 
according to them, along the lines, they decided to add more stuff. So, you know, the only thing that they were gonna add was Dragon Fruit Rework and then Divine Arts. But now, look, there's the Dragon Heart now. There's the Dragon Blade now, which wasn't really part of their plan before. And then there's a lot of stuff that they're planning on adding in this update, which is probably one of the reasons why it's taking so long. So here we are gonna not talk about the reason why the drag the updates in general for block suits takes ages. Not just this update, but update 20, for example, took I believe eight, ten months to release. Yeah, update 20 took somewhere around 10 months to release. That's how long update 20 took. Um, it was longer, I think it was almost a year. It's almost pretty much a year for the update to release in update 20. And for this update, the reason why it's taking so long, or for the updates in general, the reason why they're taking so long is because number one, if you take a look at the player base of block suits, okay, they have 600,000, 500,000 concurrent players. Although a lot of that may be hackers and bots, a lot of that may be hackers and bots, they still have a ton of players, they're still making a ton of money. And the reason why I think these updates are taking so long is because number one, um, I, they are gonna run out of ideas eventually. So as a content creator, for example, I know that you guys watch my videos. I know that there are some haters watching these videos right now. And I may have talked about this video before, but there's really not that many stuff to cover in a game that doesn't update. You know, there's really not that much stuff to cover in a game that doesn't update. Um, you know, you're gonna be forced to eventually remake the same video, but try to talk about different stuff. And this is a problem that Bloxwoods is gonna run to eventually if they release updates faster. For example, if Bloxwoods decided that they were gonna release updates every single month, it would take them like five months before they start running out of stuff to add into this game. Like, if you take a look at Bloxwoods right now, there's not really that much stuff they can add into Bloxwoods from One Piece. You can still add the Magnet Fruits, which is kind of good. They can still add a lot of fruits, but they can't really add that many more fruits into the game. They can still add a couple of fruits, like maybe three or four more fruits. But if they add all of those in the span of five months because they release consistent updates, they're going to run out of fruits to add eventually. And what's, what's going to happen is people are eventually going to get bored and people are eventually going to move out of the, move away from the game for example if you take a look at other games like shindo life where they updated very consistently shindo life ran out of stuff to add in shindo life and eventually they did collabs and that was the downfall of the game because each collab they added was stronger than the last and balance was pretty much ruined and i think that's one one of the things that the blocksfoots developers are trying to not happen to blocksfoots which is why they're not really locking in per se into this update because remember I have talked to other developers as well, and I mentioned this to them. And I talked to other developers and I asked them, um, why does Bloxwoods not release updates as fast? And you know, other developers, for example, the developers of Anime Last Stand, I asked them. And what they said was, with the money that the Bloxwoods developers have, they can release updates so much faster, but they're not. And that got me thinking, and the reason why they don't really release updates that much is because of what I just talked about. They don't want to run out of stuff to add into the game because eventually once that happens, that could be the start of the downfall of the game. Side note, they could also be just pretty lazy and the reason why I'm saying this to you guys is because I want to try to understand the developers as well. I don't just want to call them lazy and stuff like that. But there is a chance that they're just lazy which is why they're taking so long with the updates but you decide what's better. In my opinion, it's better to understand them as well because I think they are trying to do what's best for the game in their mind. So yeah, they're probably trying to conserve these stuff because if they really want to, they can add these stuff in like a month because they could hire more developers with the money that they have, which is insane. They have millions and they could hire a lot of developers to start working on these updates. So I think that's really one of the reasons why they're trying to not update as fast because there's really no reason for them to take as long as they are right now. Okay. Anyways, that's gonna be it for today's video. I really just wanted to talk about this because a lot of people were very curious as to why Bloxwoods developers take so long to release updates. And yeah, there you go. I talked about the reasons why this update got delayed and why future updates will also get delayed. So by the way, before I end this video, don't hope that Bloxwoods is gonna release consistent updates anymore. They're not. They're always gonna be like this where they will take long breaks before they're gonna release an update. In fact, this Dragon Fruit rework might not release in April. This Dragon Fruit rework might release in May or maybe even in October. It might take that long, I'm not too sure, okay? But yeah, hopefully this Dragon Fruit rework will release in April, but um, the next update after Dragon Fruit rework will probably take months as well. That's gonna be it. See you guys in the next one.
Oh, oh, oh.